Guys, this is our last day here at Rannoch Arran in Isle of Arran. So, I just thought I'd do a quick little video of the place. So, when you turn up, this is what it's like. Very natural, very old, very peaceful lovely couple that run the place um, do things kind of environmentally friendly have their own herb gardens um, don't like using a lot of plastics just like everything all natural so it's really really nice so you just walk along the gravel path um, they have bees I think it's bees over there and their own little Oh, there's, there's a bunny. Can you see that bunny? Can you see that bunny, guys? <laughs> there are hundreds of bunnies running around here. Loads. So, yeah. They have their own little trees and stuff. And the Grand Roman Garden. With um, herbs, plants and foods and stuff. Trees. It's absolutely so peaceful here, it's unreal. As you can tell, it's peaceful. That's a sign saying to the Europe's. <laughs> so if you go up that way, it takes you to like a woodland walk. All the way up there. This is the entrance to where you come to go to the yurts. This is their forest garden. Beware of the goose. There's that lovely male goose there. He's very protective of his lovely lady. Tea garden. Growing their own tea. Lots of bluebells. Lovely new trees planted. <laughs> Ooh. As you can hear, he's very protective. He's okay. Here he comes. Tell me off. <laughs> Come and tell me off, are you? Hello. Hello. You coming to tell me off, are you? Yes. We got given um, a goose egg by the lovely owner, Pippa, yesterday, and it's huge, about the size of my hand. Um, obviously, you can eat goose eggs, but we've never ate one before. In there is rhubarb. And you can go in the garden, but I don't want to go in and disturb the goose. There's all sorts of this, like a herb garden. As you can see, planted new trees. So yeah, in another few years, this is going to be absolutely perfect and thick with fresh food and everything um, to be started. Uh, this block here has got the kitchen in the first room. And the other three little cubicles are the bathrooms, 
to use because I said it's kind of glamping. There's three yurts there, uh, four bed and two six beds. We're in the one over here. Sorry guys, my phone cut out there. So anyway, the toilet blocks, shower block, shower room, as is the yellow door. The fan stays on because it's a compost toilet and it blows air to keep it all so it doesn't smell. So it has everything in it, shower, heated towel rail. This is all solar powered. So I said they're doing all, everything environment friendly. Excuse, excuse our dirty towels, that's where we were told to leave them. But yeah, as you can see, it's very nice and clean. And that's the view of where we are. So here's a quick view of the kitchen. There's a washing machine in it. She's got little herbs out that everybody wants to use. Eco-friendly, wash not liquid. Fridge. Sorry guys, my phone keeps cutting out. And the bin, microwave, kettle, toaster. She leaves eggs um, from the chickens in the fridge and you leave a little donation so you can have some eggs. And leaflets and everything. So yeah, this is the kitchen. So that's a little quick view of the Rannock Add It In uh, glamping site that we're on. And that's our bench set and fire pit. Obviously our yurt, my daughter Siobhan outside. And there's some fresh trees. These are cherry blossoms that have just started. As you can see, it just started growing. So in about another year or so, it will look even more prettier than what it is now. There we go, guys. Quick view of Ronak at it in. Speak to you soon. Ciao for now. So guys, that's my video for today. Nothing fancy. We're just chilling out today. Just went for a little walk. I said to the church down the little shop. I'm just around the area. We're chilling out today because we're going home tomorrow. And after all that hill walking and everything yesterday, we're all pooped. So I'm gonna go now, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your comments. Ciao for now.